<laughs> I can't believe it. It's beautiful. Oh, I've been saving since his last birthday. It's won an illuminable watch since before we even got married. Tonight's going to be perfect. I can't wait. Oh, well, it's a great idea. I just hope everything goes well for the both of you. What is it, Claudia? I can tell when you're not telling me something. Well, I, oh, I'm... you don't think he found out what I got him, do you? He hasn't said anything at work, right? Because no. I cannot let the surprise get ruined. No, don't worry. Don't worry. He doesn't know. We work on different floors. We rarely run into each other. Like, never. Okay. Uh, but, you know, I, I have read that there's been a lot of watch scams going on lately. Watch scams? Come on. Yeah, like a shop will sell authentic, illumable watches, charge tens of thousands of dollars just to find out that the watches are counterfeit. Oh, uh, we don't have to worry about any of that. I did so much research before I dropped any money on this thing. Do you mind if I take a closer look at it? Just to be on the safe side. Uh... Sure, okay. Okay, all right. Aha! What is it? What? Right here, there's supposed to be a little engraving. Check it out. That's how you know if it's an authentic Illumable watch or not. Engraving? What kind of engraving? The Illumable company catchphrase. Catchphrase? What? Yeah, uh, Illumable watches, uh, you, you can't check the time without them. How did I not know about the official catchphrase? Oh, honey, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Oh, no, oh, this is terrible. I can't give Ed that fake watch. If he finds out it's fake, he's gonna think I'm an idiot. Oh yeah, no, no, that would, that would ruin everything. What am I gonna do? I still have to prepare dinner and do my hair and get ready and I can't... You know, I have the day off. I could take this fake old watch back to the shop, get you a replacement gift to give to Ed tonight. Oh, you're the best. <laughs> okay, so I will come back before dinner and I'll bring the new gift for you to give to Ed tonight, okay? Thank you. Bye. Bye. Come in. Hey, hot stuff. Claudia, I... I thought you had the day off. But I thought you'd be sad if I didn't stop by and wish you happy birthday. Happy birthday, <gasps> baby. Come on, you know you're happy to see me. Uh, I am, but... I, uh, you know, I have something for you. No, hey, we gotta be careful. Here at work, you never know who could be listening or watching. Oh, let him watch and listen. No, no, we have to be careful. You know they have a no dating colleagues policy here, and HR isn't gonna give us an exception just because they love me. So, you won't break up with Olivia. We can't go public at work. How are we gonna keep this up, huh? I have been your dirty little secret for two years. I thought you wanted to be with me. I do, but I also don't want to get fired. We don't have to get fired. We can quit our jobs and get new jobs. I've worked too hard to get this job. Well, I worked too hard to get you. Babe, I'll break up with Olivia soon. I promise. You know I'm wild about you. Well, you could have fooled me. No, seriously. You're the excitement in my life. And Olivia is just so boring. Listen, I'll tell you what. How about if I come over to your place tonight after my birthday dinner and we can celebrate our own way? <laughs> okay. But you better show me a good time. Don't I always? Yes. <laughs> yeah. Now you better get on out of here before the boss discovers us. I'll see you tonight. Gorgeous. Bye. Well, 
I am just so sick and tired of waiting. If you're not going to break up with Olivia, I'll just have to do it for you. What's for dinner? Happy birthday, honey. What's for dinner? Well, how about we get to that after a welcome home hug? <laughs> honey, what's the matter with you? Nothing. Just a long day at work. Well, my poor man. Come and sit. I've got a very expensive truffle carbonara ready for you. Perfect. I hope you like it, because it's really all I've got for you tonight. What do you mean? Well, I got you a present. I swear I did, but then Claudia said I got the wrong thing, you so I... You saw Claudia today? Yeah, she came over for a bit this morning. Why? What's wrong? Nothing. Oh, are you sure? Because you looked a little crazy the second I said Claudia. I didn't look crazy. You're the one that looks crazy in that goofy cocktail dress. Even I can tell how cheap it is. Babe, what's gotten into you? You look like a clown. You're, you're trying too hard. It's a big turnoff. Why are you being so mean to me? I was just trying to make tonight special for you. Uh-huh, great. Yeah, so you look like a clown. You didn't even get me a decent birthday present. Great job so far, honey. All I want is a nice, quiet, peaceful evening. So could you just calm down? I'm sorry, Ed. I'm sorry I tried too hard. That's better. Well, could you get that? I'm about to eat. Claudia, why are you all dressed up? <coughs> um, Claudia? What, what are you doing here? Well, you couldn't expect me to miss out on my man special night now, could you? Your man? Claudia, this isn't what we discussed. What's going on with you two? I just wanted to give you a birthday present. Happy birthday, baby. Oh. Is... This, uh, an Illumable watch? You bet it is! I know how long you've wanted one. No! Oh, man, I'm gonna feel like such an alpha with this on. Thanks, babe. Oh, babe! You're welcome. How dare you? You didn't buy that watch. You were supposed to be returning it for me because you said it was a fake. Well, I couldn't very well let you get my man a real illumable watch now, could I? Didn't you hear him? I'm the one who makes his dreams come true. You were supposed to be my best friend. How could you do this to me? How long has this been going on? I'm gonna kill you, Claudia. Let's face it, Olivia, you're boring. It's not Ed's fault that he lost interest in you. He just needed a real woman like me. Oh, how dare you? You! You're protecting her! Olivia, I didn't really want you to find out this way, but Claudia's right. This life with you, it's its just so boring. You didn't even try to talk to me about it. We could have worked this out. Oh, stop, Olivia. You're making yourself sound so pathetic. Okay, you two want each other? Fine. Get out of this house. I don't ever want to see either of you ever again. Right, Olivia... Get out before I make you. Fine. Let's go, Ed. We have a nice evening planned, right, honey? Mm-hmm. She was my best friend. And he was my husband. How could they do this to me for so long? After all these years of marriage, I'm left all alone now. Sweetie, where are we going? It's a surprise. All right. <laughs> Stop. Okay. Well, surprise. Happy birthday. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> this is perfect. You're perfect. Oh. Thank you, Olivia, for doing all this. Of course, Ronald. I just wanted to make today special for you, since you're such an amazing boyfriend. Oh, thank you. It's the I same old thing every time with I you. I found the panties underneath. Yeah, but well, maybe no, if you dress mine. like that, we'd have a little more heat in our relationship. Oh, stop it already! 
Shall we open the wine? Yes. I've had it! Here's your watch back! I'm out of here! Yeah! It's crazy how one year ago, my husband cheated on me with my best friend. I thought I would never get my happy ending, but here I am with Ronald. Someone who loves and cherishes me. I guess everything happens for a reason. <laughs>